Okay, there we go. No, going to Twitch. Oh, it's still freaking doing that. Yeah, uh, sometimes. Where it's uh, not telling me I'm live. It's like, God damn it. Whatever, I guess. Okay, now I get to turn up the brightness. Not that much. There we go. Get the remote out of here. I don't want to accident press anything. Oh, um, how much is my controller? Yeah, I just plugged it in, so it's not even, uh, one bar yet. Oh, yeah. I can do this. Um. Oh, yeah, and this. I'll roll for her instead of her because I already have her. Let's see how bad this roll is. God damn. Okay, yes. Really? Uh, of course, what did I expect? I don't know. Now let's try for this. Because why not? I have 10. So who cares? Let's see how bad this is. Oh. Um. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Uh. Yan Fei. So you could still get Yanfei? Oh. Oh, I don't know that. Um. Oh, he does have that. Where the hell is Noel? Did it pass her and not even know? Oh, yeah, I did. She's already on her four. Damn. Oh, four. I can Can I, do I have enough? No, of course not. But uh, start off by doing this. So,
try not to enjoy this too. You're in toast! <laughs> this might hurt a little. Share my knowledge. So I'm confused what she even does. Can you saw? <laughs> Freaking that's so annoying. Okay. Let the show begin. Committed to memory. Yeah, she sounds terrible, but yeah, I don't know. I'd rather have someone else, to be honest. And I accidentally freaking went in again. I forgot it's triangle, not X, to um, I uh, get the materials. Um, should I? Yeah, why not? But, yeah. Oops, I don't have enough energy. Stamina or whatever. Orders given. Orders received. Of course. Of course. My ears issues hell. Nothing better to do. We could go foraging for ingredients. Yeah, that's annoying. Whatever. And, um, yeah, I think I'm gonna redo that. Uh, Stubbs Zombie, because I realized, um, yeah, yesterday I, I don't know why I played again, because I really don't feel like it. Because I was just so freaking tired. It's like, yeah, just stop doing that. Like, when you're tired, just don't freaking game because you're not gonna want to. Because when I was younger, I didn't care, but now it's like, damn. Yeah, I don't really know what changed.
Yeah, to be honest, I don't know. <laughs> but whatever. I think it's just an age thing. Yeah, I was like that uh, too, like, ha ha ha, freaking you're old, blah blah blah, it's like, ha ha, you'll get out there too, <laughs> you'll be old too, <laughs> so, I don't know, it's just a stupid thing, <laughs> I don't know why it was like that actually, because it's like, Yeah, I just don't understand why I found that funny because, or joked about it because it's like, you, no matter what, you'll eventually get old. So it's like, um, yes, that's just a weird thing to do in my opinion. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but oh well. But yeah, it's just an age thing, I guess. Weirdly enough. Oops. Go in the frickin'. As we discussed earlier, I've brought someone with me. <laughs> Mr. Alhatham, I'm aware of where you stand, but how can I make sure that your friends think the same as you? Huh? What do you mean? But whatever. But uh, yeah, that stubs thing I... Uh, that stubs game, I only played one level. Then I was going to play the second level, then I screwed up and accidentally restarted the level. It's like, whatever, I'll do it again. It's, it wasn't that long anyways. Like, I have a redo the second level anyways. So I might as well redo the first level. I know you two are friends. That's why I'm willing to talk to you, even though I do have some reservations. Before, I wouldn't even have the courage to ask something like this. Traveler, do you believe our lives will get better? Oh, it does have a time date. Yeah, we came here from another nation, so it is okay. a you to be weary. Okay, so 27 but more days. Really I'm pretty sure world. I could play remote play so. for 15 people more people minutes in that and time. We've always fought for what we believed in. We have friends in Sumeru, and we want to help them. That's why we decided to stay here for a while. Well, I gotta play where I'm gonna play for five more minutes, I, uh, three separate you. times. My apologies for posing my questions like that. But to be honest, I didn't expect you to come back for more information. And yeah, in 27 days, I think I'll it's be okay. able to do that. The fact is that I'm... Only one side of my family is desert folk. I don't really fit in anywhere in Sumeru. Some believe in the Dendro Archon, while others believe in King Deshred. I don't belong to either side, and neither side would want me. Speaking of which, the Radicals mentioned that they despise traitors. Do they just think that anyone who's different from them is a traitor? Yeah. Some people can be so narrow-minded when it comes to bloodline and beliefs. It makes no difference what I say or how I behave. 
I'll always be suspected of having ulterior motives. Slowly, I just stopped talking to people. I pretended not to hear or see anything. All I want is to live my life in peace. And then it happened. The village keepers who had helped me disappeared with no explanation, and I didn't dare breathe a word about it to anyone. Until now. You can tell them. I'm sure she'll keep your secret. <laughs> All right. I'll tell you what I told Al Haytham. I actually have a sharper sense of hearing than most. Sometimes, I hear strange crying sounds in the night. <laughs> there are ghosts? Perhaps. I'm not sure. It's faint, but it's definitely the sound of crying. It comes from far away in the distance, and always carries very raw emotion. It used to be louder and more frequent. But ever since you arrived in the village, it doesn't seem to happen as often. And when it does, it's much quieter. I have to focus really hard to make it out. I confirmed this with the guards on night duty. They also have someone with a good ear, and he's heard similar sounds at night. But, because we're in the middle of a desert, he would rather believe that they are the cries of beasts than ghosts. There's really nothing around these parts. Except for an old hospital not far from the village. I think they used to use it for treating Elazar, but it's been abandoned for years. Yeah, let's go! Okay. Um, I'm gonna do that later. <clears throat> Uh, what place is that? Is in this place called? Uh, Oh no, I... Oh... Ah, uh, does this have a reputation, uh, place? Or no? That's a sanctuary. And that's... So this place doesn't have a reputation system? Oh, I thought it did. a thing because Yeah, the freaking PS5 is, well, it's faster than some PCs, I think, older than, like, 2020 PCs. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, when did they start to development of the peace fire? Yeah, I think the PS5 is better than 2019 PCs or 2020, one of the two. Empty and forgotten. It's not like I'm trying to say ha ha uh peace fires and master race or something stupid like that. <laughs> because I really don't understand that. But whatever, it's fanboys. Oh, he's in the hall, I think. Oh yeah, with the PlayStation uh, Plus, I mean PlayStation Stars. Like this, that um, like when you read on the points, like does it go into the account or just? Uh, gives you a uh, just a code. I don't know. I would think it just gives you. Like it just goes into your account. Rather than just a code. Like, I would prefer it to just be cold, but I doubt it will be. Because I see that because, um, that would, uh, kind of discourage you from making multiple accounts multiple places and star accounts Brace you. 
But yeah, if that's the case, I'll probably, uh... I don't want to do it, but I'll probably buy, um... Like, sometimes I'll buy games, but most of the time I think I'll buy, uh... Uh, microtransactions for this game. It's like, hell, I'm not paying for it, so who cares? If I was, yeah, that would be a different story, obviously. But yeah, I'm not paying for it. Oh, uh, with PlayStation Plus. Oh, uh, PlayStation Stars, I mean. But I don't know, who knows. What I do, I think I'll do that though. Like, focus on, uh... Like, I'm not going to say would, it's not going to suck, I wish it was a code, but I doubt it will be, like I said, I really do doubt it will. Because like I said, it's too... Discourage frickin' uh, multiple accounts. At least to me, that would make sense. Uh, yeah, they would do that because it would discourage multiple accounts and then... Obviously, they wouldn't have a pay, but maybe I'm wrong. Who knows? That would be cool if I'm wrong, though. But, um, I tried to look on the internet, and I couldn't find anything about that. It's like I have, uh, check it out myself. Yeah, I don't think you do. Or I could be wrong, let's see. So for, um, yeah, a thousand points, well, I could check on my other phone. Yeah, I will do that. One second. I'm just, uh, seeing if there's a discount. 
if you get 25 uh, credit over $5 credit. Or are they the same? So, oh yeah, the $5 credit is one. 1,250 points and the 25 credit is 6,250 points so it's like yeah there's no difference <laughs> because Obviously, 1,000 times 5 is 5,000, but then add uh, 250 times 5 is 1,050, so it's like, yeah, it's the same price no matter what. Uh, for the $5 or for the uh, 6,000. I mean $25 credit for PlayStation Star so they're the same. That kind of sucks. I didn't change my uh They were easier to deal with than Paimon had expected. Uh, I didn't change you know, my thing back. Or monsters taller than Billy. Oh my team. Oopsies. Or, you know, something like that. Hmm. You look super serious. We gotta stay on our A game. But too. yeah, that's so weird. This is the one. But I guess whatever. I'll try to find that again, PlayStation stores. Let's go in and take a look. Okay. Oh. I thought I would. Shawnee says she only hears the crying at night. We have time to burn. Until then. I'm taking a break. <sighs> and just like that, he sits down. Wait, he even brought a book to read? What are you reading? Let Paimon see! Okay, sure. Position, which is the positional propensity of an entity in natural motion in contrast with oh. an object in forced motion? It uh, doesn't tell you. Free from external influences, every entity displays the tendency to follow its natural trajectory? So, um, you got that? Oh, Paimon gives up. You keep reading your book. See ya. How is he so relaxed? Look at him, reading an impossible book in a creepy place like this. Hey, yeah, it won't tell me. It just says... How to get a uh, free and be saying uh, cash in that? It's like, no, I want to know if it's a code, if it 
Yeah, if it's a toll that gets mailed to you, emailed to you, to your account, or your email, obviously. Um, or if it's just, uh, or if it just gets applied to your account. It's coming from that direction. Yeah, I guess I have to, uh... Yeah, I guess I have to freaking get it's from below that. But there's no way we can get down there. Something is off about the interior here. Hmm. As I thought. There's a hidden structure. Wow. It's like they tucked another hospital into this one. Well, it looks like there are other mechanisms around here. Let's keep exploring. So, yeah, I really don't know. That sucks. I'm gonna have to find out in a freaking around a month. Well, obviously, I'm not gonna find out right away because um, I have uh, accumulated uh, points and I don't plan to freaking just go on a spending spree to see. That would be kind of dumb, honestly. Jesus, I went flying. Why is it so freaking hard to kill? God damn. So yeah, I really wonder. Oh god, I've changed my team, but freaking this stupid freaking stick drift. Oh my god, at the last second. Oh my god, I see something. Ready, Is that? No, that's not the same thing. I'll ensure your safety.
I'm gonna check this. I need this. Or I need... Oh. I, uh... Thought I needed... A venti, but I guess not. I'm glad I freaking did that then. Uh, tried both of them. Because, yeah, I would have been screwed if I only did that. Now I'm just being bold. Link, I don't think oh, there's so. any reason to fight these guys. Yeah, I don't know. I wish it was way quicker. We can do this. Like, don't get me wrong, I understand why it's not quicker, but at the same time, it's just. Kind of dumb. Like, obviously, it's not quick because, um... Obviously, because, uh... Yeah, people... Like enemies could still hit you. But uh, having to stay absolutely still is just nonsense. It's like, really, why though? Oh yeah, I could get out of here. I'll do that if I can. Oh, it won't allow me to get them on a freaking wall. Um. Oh. Yeah, it's like, um, what is it? Oh, yeah, when I was, uh, 
like when freaking Zelda fan was here, it's like, oh, why don't you, uh, re like, read all that? Like, on the world events, it's like, I don't know, I'm not used to that. Like, p like Nintendo fans obviously are, because, weirdly... Yeah, weirdly, freaking Nintendo gets away with not voicing their games. But if Xbox or PlayStation did that, no, I don't think they could get away with that at all. to see him here you know him he's razak a senior of mine at the academia he's a scholar too but um they save money on freaking voice acting no. i guess and that's the problem razak was never involved in any of those things he never trained in the forest let alone reach satyavada life yeah i guess they save money on voice acting God damn it. Leaving that question aside for the moment. Him being here alone means that we might be too late. Looks like they've already taken everyone away. For whatever reason, they left Razak here. Perhaps they simply didn't have time to come back for him. Hmm. There are drag marks on the ground. They're clearer by the doorway. Someone was forcefully drawing a cart that was loaded with something heavy. Loaded? That is one possibility. Hmm. It looks like they were in a hurry, as if they were afraid of being caught. In their haste, they failed to notice Razak hiding in a corner. The symptoms are identical. Looks like we found living proof. Huh? Why do you say that? Allow me to jog your memory. Recall your time at Port Ormos. Don't you think his symptoms look familiar? Oh! Now that you mention it, they're acting the same way! Correct. The Academia is behind all of this. It isn't difficult to deduce their rationale. First, the Academia spread a false rumor of King Deshret's resurrection, emphasizing the role of the village keepers, the mad scholars who were exiled to Aru village. These rumors were all the persuasion that the radicals needed, and those based in Aru village leapt into action. Unbeknownst to them, of course, through rounding up the scholars, they were actually helping the academia. As well as being able to exploit the radicals for their own ends, this scheme has one further advantage to the academia. All the risks and responsibilities are offloaded onto King Deshret's followers. Life for the desert dwellers has been brutal ever since King Deshret's death all those years ago. Beneath the surface, feelings of desperation are widespread. Many would give everything they have for the prospect of something better. Anyone looking to exploit that for their own ends simply needs to make a few empty promises. Even if complications arise, people will see that those involved are all followers of King Deshret and look for no further explanation than differences of belief. A deep-seated mistrust of the desert and everyone in it by the rest of Sumeru will make sure of that. The notion of an academia plot wouldn't even cross their minds. It may seem like a simple strategy, but it is able to work wonders under Sumeru's current circumstances. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. It's in line with the village chief's theory, too. But there's still one very important question. Wasn't it the academia that brought the scholars to Aru village in the first place? Why does it want them back now? Throughout this process, one thing has changed. 
the scholars' identity. First, they were scholars. Then, they became lunatics. After that, they were exiles. And finally, they become missing persons. An exile is still patently a living, breathing human being. Yeah. But when someone becomes a missing person, freaking uh, that is brought into question. Freaking if you can't find someone, you have no way of knowing what exactly happened. Probably to don't even. That makes missing people. Freaking understand people. what you're saying. The moving. information in their brains could be extracted into knowledge capsules. Extracted? You mean hand knowledge comes from people's brains? With the technology of the Sumeru Academia, it's entirely possible. Perhaps the process caused them great suffering, which is why they cry out in the dead of night when no one is watching them. So, the human brain... Oops, I have much... No, nah, Hyman doesn't want to think about this. I'm the Academia scribe, after all. I'm familiar with their projects. Anyway... Judging by Razak's state, the contents of a divine knowledge capsule were extracted from his mind. But something went wrong in the process. Or perhaps his curiosity got the better of him, and he used such a capsule for himself. Uh, Hyman's a little confused. Can they just use anyone's brain? Oh, freaking. The look yeah, I don't tells know. You've realized the answer. That's right. To some scholars, gaining knowledge about the gods is their entire life's pursuit. Extracting can knowledge is just one of the extreme measures they turn to. However,. I can't help but wonder, what do they seek to gain from divine knowledge? The academia is going out of their way to look for forbidden knowledge, but what is their ultimate goal? I've spent quite some time trying to analyze the contents of the divine knowledge capsule, but to no avail. It seems like my way of thinking is too different from theirs. You mean, you're not even slightly interested in getting your hands on this forbidden stuff? All scholars seek to expand the horizons of knowledge, but I'm not particularly interested in gods, so I don't share their degree of zealotry. Extracting information from people as if they were lifeless objects? <laughs> if this is the direction of academic progress, then the academia may as well shut its doors. Sounds like you're really against all this. Of course. The academia's actions run contrary to their rules. Whether it be academics or knowledge, everything has its boundaries. If those lines are crossed, the rules and order that govern everything in the world will be destroyed. This matter needs to be corrected, just like fixing a typo in a book. Wait, didn't you step in to help because you felt sympathy for those poor people? Not to be callous, but no. My criteria are a little more restrictive than that. There is no shortage of suffering in Sumeru. And the same can be said for the rest of Tevat as well. What do you plan to do about that? Save every last person? Um, probably not. Uh, Paimon's not sure. Oops. I go to Genshin and pack trophies put, to find that. I don't blindly place my faith into strength or heroism. I do what I want. The Divine Knowledge Capsule is something I want to investigate in full. That doesn't mean I'm willing to take action for the sake of a few strangers. Like, do they have the latest trophies too? I hope they don't have... Uh... <laughs> You're probably right. Though I must say, I quite enjoy this feeling of being the odd one out. Uniqueness is also an asset, is it not? Wow, that's a great way to think about it. Paimon's really impressed. If only Miss Shani had a similar mindset, her life would definitely be a lot easier. 
I'm just a more likable person than her in general. There's nothing more to it than that. <sighs> he won't last long if we leave him here. Let's take him with us. We'll work out our next step after we return to Aru Village. Oh, it's the only co-op trophy. God damn it. Uh, that heart-shaped uh, trophy is the only co-op trophy. That sucks. Um. There's probably a fast way to do this. So I wonder if uh, Shinobu is um if he could get Shinobu from uh, the character frickin' banner. I think this is called a, the character banner. Yeah, I think you could get all the characters, well, all four star characters from uh, that banner. But the event banner is where you get the five stars. And obviously they're not always uh, available. It's like I
Uh, do I? Uh, I have enough this, but the books I don't. It's like I already have, um, what is it? Yeah, I already have the more one, so yeah, I'll do it next week. It's not that long, the scheme renews on freaking Monday. So, yeah, it's all that far. Can this fly get out of here? Like, he's not doing anything, he's flying in front of my face, that's so annoying though. Right at the frickin' end. I don't know why they don't make it so much quicker. Time to go. Oh god. I didn't know it was, um... This. Let me scry. Jesus. Shoot. Look at my other foot. Yeah. Oh no, I can't.
There we go. Oh, God damn, that's so annoying right at the last second. Freaking Christ, how much did you want me to do? Taking a stroll in the middle. Thank you for completing oh, I guess I will Uh, do they still have the domain one? Hmm. Oh yeah, complete 10 domain challenges. Okay, they still have that, like the domain ones, I could do. Sure, there would be a bit of a grind, but I could do. I usually do uh, the abyss, uh, spiral abyss, uh, for domains. But there's one domain here, right, that I could do. Don't remember where. And it's not telling me for some reason. Yeah, where is that domain? God damn it, I hate it that it's not telling me. Because, yeah, there is a domain somewhere here. Oh, what? So there was a domain there, it just wasn't telling me at all. Why? Why was it doing that? That's so weird.
sacred name, fortune preserve. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if I could have done that without, um, that. Okay, it's two bars. I totally forgot to look at that. Oh, to look at my controller, how much it's charged. <laughs> Yeah, it's weird now. I don't mind switching in that. Like switching characters. I don't mind doing a lot of things. <laughs> oh, he's got the loading is so much faster. We're back. And I know it's like tired. whatever to PC players, but water. like I don't know me having a console and hmm. being stuck with What's a this? hard drive. <laughs> Yeah, it's a uh, lot better. Grandfather. Nevertheless, he's one of the people we're trying to find. So, at one point in time, the abandoned Elazar Hospital served as the academia's site for extracting divine Cant knowledge. 
Their plan must have been implemented at some point before we arrived at Aru Village, since Divine Cant and Knowledge has been in circulation for a while now. Yet, they fled once we were headed to the village. Almost well, as I guess we you could have gotten a Why is that? SSD Why is with that? the PS5, we but it's like... Moments. One of us yeah, I don't know. Our whereabouts to the academia. Huh? Are our friendships that shallow? It only freaking goes like none of you have with most PS4 games. It only goes like three, four seconds faster, Sorry, and it's hey, like you're the reason why they can predict our movements. Is that really worth it? Choose your next words very carefully. It is simply like it still was incredibly slow. So what you're saying is, Sino's the mole. Interesting. And here I thought you were the most unlike most PS5 games. Acting alone. I know. You have a point, but I realize what am I saying? Most PS5 games, Sino all PS5 games. <laughs> What are you trying to say? Do you still remember who you are, General Mahamadra? <laughs> As a Matra, you are no doubt privy to certain kinds of information. Before you can take action against someone, you are required to have all the facts available, including the less than savory details. Simply put, the Academia has traditionally allowed you access to a wealth of sensitive information. Knowing their modus operandi, wouldn't you expect them to take precautions against you? If you want to raise a vicious wolf, you need to make sure that you are not talk after this. The academia is monitoring me? It's not that simple. The academia has eyes all over Sumeru, but they have a special protocol for dealing with you. Every so often comes a Nyagarbaha day. On this day, the Academia enters new information into the Akasha through knowledge capsules. I remember seeing a thick notebook next to the control panel once. Its contents were all about the General Mahamatra, his activities throughout the day, preferred methods of enacting judgment, everything. You're saying that the Academia entered my information into the Akasha too? But what's the point in doing that? My actions aren't important enough to be added into the Akasha. The Akasha is capable of computation. <sighs> the Akasha's algorithms are entirely capable of predicting your movements using the data entered. When you would depart, the route you would follow, your destination. It knew all of this. It predicted my every move. The Academia has been watching you longer than you think. However, the fact that you resigned is proof that their suspicions were well-founded. So that's how it is. Sino adheres to his principles so strongly that he's actually a thorn in their side. Tenacity of will and steadfast faith are worthless to the Academia. They need scholars who are easily pliable and mindlessly go after anything they can profit from. Sino, don't take it to heart. This just proves how much of a trustworthy ally you are. <sighs> they escaped because of me. Don't blame yourself. Not like any of us would have known. I have an idea. If they predicted my movements, then I might be able to guess where they went. Whoa, you bounce back fast. There is always an opportunity for safety after danger passes. Oh, so that's how it is! Hyman gets it now! If the academia is trying to avoid Sino, then the safest place would be. They'll want to proceed in the direction opposite of where I'm going. Yeah. I must go. Oh, uh, who's There's the next uh, banner? Let's go, guys! After him! Because, yeah, I think um, I go I'm gonna save up for the next banner. 
If so, you have to promise you'll stay safe. Because, um, Grandpa, I promise what's her name? And not cause any trouble. Everyone, I leave him in your uh, I forget her name from the current banners. I'm not going to say she's bad, but she's not good. So she's just okay, I would get, I would think. But anyway, whatever. Oh yeah, I, f I don't know why I do that. But I think I wouldn't do that, like, go to Fireboy channels if they weren't. Just so dumb. <laughs> because, um, obviously there was that thing. Like, oh, the Series S is holding back uh, games and then... This one fanboy channel said like, oh, there's a thing on Twitter that says uh, the PS4 is holding back out of War Ragnarok. So it's the PS4 that's holding back uh, the PS5, not the Xbox Series S. Like going weirdly defensive, <laughs> but whatever. But all that says to me is like all weaker hardware, no matter if it's last gen or current gen, holds back um, more powerful consoles. Like, I don't know, do you not get yeah do you not take that from uh that from the de from that developer saying that of course you don't it's about the console wars a hundred percent everything's about the console wars which i do not understand <laughs> Like, why does a hundred percent absolutely everything need to be about the console wars? It doesn't make sense. Life goes on. To me, to be honest. But whatever, I guess. It's just fanboys being fanboys. I don't know, I just found that just maybe not a funny but just brain dead. It's like god damn. Whatever. Oh shoot, I was gonna say something else I completely forgot. God damn, and I guess it will come back eventually.
Yeah, I guess that's all I'll say. You will come back to me eventually. Oh, now I remember. Freaking Christ. I, like, feels... I don't want to sound like a negative and antsy, but it's true. That Minecraft? And, uh, what is it? Oh yeah, Minecraft and that are different. Minecraft and Call of Duty are way different because minecraft uh, like never um had a freaking another game in the series until uh what is it oh yeah until freaking minecraft dungeons And, um, Call of Duty is a yearly series. And obviously there's other differences, like it's a shooter and that. But yeah, it's like, at least to me, freaking Call of Duty and Minecraft, like, kind of couldn't be farther, uh, like, different. And, um, like, people will say, like, uh, what is it? Oh, yeah, that Xbox intends to freaking, uh, keep Call of Duty on PlayStation, but it's like, uh, people are picking apart those words because obviously if you intend to do something it's like you can do it but it's not guaranteed that you will do it so people are just picking part of that and it's like yeah, it's kind of true, <laughs> obviously. If you intend to do something, it doesn't guarantee uh, whatever of Call of Duty on PlayStation always. Because obviously uh, Microsoft is uh, going to put Call of Duty on Game Pass it, when they get uh, Activision they're going to put Call of Duty on Game Pass they won for ten dollars or you could get it on PlayStation for um, seventy dollars or obviously 80 in uh, Canada it's like um don't you think that's an unfair advantage right there <laughs> and then a slightly anti-consumer freaking thing right there as well uh, an anti-consumer move right there as well. Because it's like... 
If Sony decides to put Call of Duty on PlayStation Plus, like Microsoft could just say no. But if, but then in turn, if uh, they want to lower the price of uh, Call of Duty, they can't do that either. Because the price is determined uh, by the publisher, which um, which Microsoft will own. So they could just uh, strong arm Sony to making the game stay at that $70 price tag. Yeah, I think people weirdly don't know the difference between um, a contract and owning um, and owning the publisher. It's like with a contract, like everything in the contract has to be agreed upon. When, but when you're the owner of a company, it's like you could strong arm the company to doing what you want. That's a difference. So, like, when the contract uh, for Call of Duty is up for Sony, then Microsoft could buy the contract afterwards. I don't know why I'm cold. What the hell? But anyways, yeah, Microsoft could buy the contract afterwards. But I remember, um, what is it? Oh, yeah, I remember uh, a thing on Twitter. A guy said it's like freaking um, Sony uses their market share to, uh, to determine, uh, freaking like the person that of stuff. And it's like, do they? Do they really? Because if that's true, then how did Microsoft, uh, how is Microsoft able to buy Activision? Because if they're able to determine pricing that, when they make it a price that Microsoft just can't freaking compete with. So, people saying uh, Sony's using their market lead is kind of a lie. I'm not saying it's a 100% false because I don't know, obviously. But seeing that uh, Microsoft can't compete with uh, Sony is such a freaking lie. <laughs> it's just, um, yeah, weirdly, freaking um, fanboys want you to think that it's like, oh, poor Microsoft. It's like, bullshit. Like, sorry, but bullshit. So, where do we go from here? Yes. After leaving the village, we should head straight toward the desert. the desert like the back of my hand is that because you play here a lot yep 
One time, Grandpa almost got lost in the desert. But I was the one who brought him back. There's something here. What's this? It's buried in the sand. Hmm. Looks like we'll need to roll up our sleeves and do some work. These are likely fragments of an academia-developed device, something akin to a headset. Looks like there were more than one village. I don't know. I they just really don't believe that with how much money Microsoft has and how little money Sony has for at least compared to Microsoft. <laughs> that, yeah, Microsoft can't compete. This is definitely a device used it's to just a really, How did it end up really sand? dumb thing to say. It can't have been part of the plan. And really trying to convince people Wait, that Grandpa, I hope you're okay. Sony buying Activision is the know. right thing to do. It's like, the sack didn't any okay, signs of or dehydration. that doesn't Which make sense. We should be able to catch up. One more thing. Given that the device had been entirely covered by sand, I believe the attack must have happened prior to the sandstorm. Let's keep going. They can't have gone far. You're flying, aren't you, Paimon? Is flying over sand tiring, too? Ugh, of course it is! Yeah, it's like, I don't mean to be whatever, but... It's just like, people are pointing out Sony's hypocrisy, then... Like... Microsoft is, or is Xbox is doing the exact same thing and no one's it's saying it's anything like about that. Whoa, it's like, okay. Like Don't get any closer. They'll notice us. Diaz talking with the Aramites? Hmm. Very interesting. Let's listen in. If you had informed me sooner, there'd be plenty of room for us to... You're one of us. We would never lie. Scholars, you don't know as much as I do. Need me to? <laughs> I knew it. That's our dear. Dia? Why would you? Dia! Hey, what are you doing? Huh? Didn't you say you'd help me find Grandpa? What? Why are you on their side? <laughs> well, look who's here. Ain't that something? Ugh, this complicates things. You've betrayed Aru village? So, this is the great General Mahamatra. Dear, you'd be better off as my assistant than hanging around with this motley crew. Seen for yourself, I have the means and methods. And my ideals are far more admirable than theirs. I'm not the type that's easily swayed, Raman. You of all people should know that. Wait, what's going on, Dia? Whose side are you on here? Shut it, Paimon. It doesn't matter. Whichever side you pick, nothing can deter us from the grand mission of resurrecting King Deshret. Once our Lord of Old returns to this land, we will have a new beginning. Face the facts, Raman. It's not gonna happen. You should understand that more than anyone. Have all your years as a merc taught you nothing about placing hopes in a ruler? I'm a desert dweller and a proud follower of King Deshret. 
Whether I live by the edge of the sword or in peaceful comfort, my soul will always carry this conviction. It's not too late yet. The village keep... <clears throat> Mad scholars aren't gonna bring King Deshret back to life. You don't understand, my dear lady. Pursuing our faith is our purpose in life. Even if the chance of success is one in a million, we must be willing to give everything we have. Even if it'll expose you to the academia? Even if they end up disbanding the Aramites? Your Aramites, which you've worked so hard for all these years? Yes. We've waited a long time for this day to come. The sun and the moon no longer shine here. All you see now is cracks in this desiccated land. But fate has finally dealt me a hand to play against the Academia. With these scholars in our custody, we'll stomp the Academia's forces and fight our way beyond the wall of Samuel. <sighs> Ridiculous. Think about it. The Academia controls the entirety of Sumeru. Your powers are negligible in comparison. If you still don't believe me, then try asking these two men. They're also against the Academia, but neither of them are as arrogant as you are. <laughs> they look more like pawns of the Academia to me. Why would I listen to anything the people of Greater Lord Ruka Devada have to say? Filthy traitors. Your god abandoned all honor and betrayed King Deshret. We desert dwellers will never trust the likes of you. It's impossible to communicate with someone so hostile. Perhaps we should. Do you really believe that by kidnapping the scholars, you'll be able to negotiate with the Academia? These people have no value as bargaining chips, but I could be persuaded to take their place as your next hostage. These scholars were exiled from the Academia. I, on the other hand, am their current scribe and will be a much greater asset to you. Wait, you can't be serious. So, you want to trade places with the hostages, do you? Precisely. Any wise person would gladly accept my offer. What are you thinking? What if they decide to kill you instead? Well, that would be bad luck for me. However, I'd get the chance to observe the scholars, perhaps even find out the truth. <sighs> Think you can talk me over with that confident look of yours? I'm not trying to persuade you. I'm using this as a means of joining forces against the Academia. You are the scribe. What do you have against the Academia? Not all desert dwellers believe in King Deshret, and the same applies to the Academia. Why must all knowledge seekers approve of the Academia's way of doing things? <laughs> You academia scum. Every last one of you is nothing but a hypocrite, just like everyone else on the other side of that wall. I've made myself clear enough. I will listen to another word from the Dendro Archon's people. Not so fast. I'll hate them. Do you stand by everything you just said? <laughs> I never make empty promises. You know you're making a dangerous decision, right? I do. Good. Raman, hear me out. These people are my friends. Maybe you can't take the followers of the Dendro Archon at their word, but what about me? Do you trust me? We've known each other for years. Of course I do. In that case, I'm willing to vouch for their honesty with my right arm. Uh, uh... Come on, Raman. Don't be a coward. If you're serious about the, taking on the academia, I, I you need think to it's yourself. done because you can't be afraid. the battery's getting a little bit hot. Main. You've piqued my interest. But what if you refuse to oblige? What should I do then? No one's a fool here, dear. We're mercs. And mercs don't tend to live long unless they have their wits about them. Um, I just wanna see. Yeah, it is. Um, at three. How long have been going? 
145. You're not wrong, but this is different. I promised my friends that we'd bring back the village keepers together. Uh, let's do it right here then. Give me your right arm as proof of your resolve. Ugh. Don't listen to him! He's not even trying to negotiate! He just wants to make things more difficult! That's fine. Are you crazy? We came here to save lives. One arm for that many people is still a pretty good deal, if you ask me. Raman, I'm holding up my end of the deal here. You'd better not let me down. Sure. Go ahead and cut off her right arm. No! Dia! What are you gonna do? Think of something! You don't have to go this far. That's not yeah, I'll probably decide. do that. Do Buy more sea chargers. And use a slow charger on my controller instead of a fast charger. Even though it's not that much faster. It's like 10-20 minutes faster. Stop. It's like... What's wrong? Can't do it? It's like seriously that it's not much faster. Cutting off your arms Only 10 20 minutes. Where's the sense in cutting my own kin to pieces? You've shown me that you're serious. Go on now, take your friends and leave. Meet me in the desert at noon tomorrow. I was really counting on him not going through with it. Dia! That was crazy! Have you all lost your minds? What if he'd actually cut your arm off? Hmm, then I'd just have to hold my claymore with my left arm. Yeah, it's weird that it only has... Uh, the PS5 <laughs> okay, only has one year speed on, limb, you gotta double down on the front. The deal, you know? Don't ever make a promise like that again. Well, that's not entirely deal with true. The of them. Oh, what if it came down to it, you would not lose to them either. I don't doubt it, Sino. But this is about more than me and them. There's a lot more where they came from. Even if we got rid of one bunch of radicals, there are others out there. Wiping them out would do more harm than good. <sighs> As you wish. I'm sorry, Dia. I should have stayed put and listened. I should have trusted you. It's okay. I promised you I'd help find your grandpa, so I'll do whatever it takes. Whatever it takes? I'll talk <laughs> you just to be material. Huh? Are you serious? Of course. The Aramites once said that I was a lunatic. Perhaps a little madness is essential to be successful in research. Why does it feel like he's using his praise for me as an excuse to brag about himself? Okay, let's get moving. We should head back to the village and rest up. Today was just a trial run. Noon tomorrow is going to be the hard part. Yeah, do you want to stop after this? Yeah, I don't know why I'm talking about that. The ports on the on front of piece 5. That there's a normal USB, uh, two point, uh, two point zero. I don't know what it is. Uh, what that connector is called. But yeah, it had, it's just a normal USB that fat end. Uh, to use be a live wire controller. So it's that 
it's fat into a controller, <laughs> obviously. And then there's a USB C uh, plug into a USB C, obviously, I need. Like, I don't know what those are called, USB mail to USB, I mean, USB-C mail to USB-C female, I don't know the difference. <laughs> like, I really don't, but whatever. Is it, like, is that a little bit faster? Like, that it's use, uh, USB C to USB C? Like, I don't know, I just don't understand why. Yeah, I don't understand why. Uh, Sony did that. Freaking hiccups. Because this is it a little bit faster charging? Or something? Because freaking now I go out and buy a separate freaking card just for that. It's like it's extremely annoying, <laughs> but whatever, I guess. It's like, um, I don't know, she says that, but, like, is it really? Um, where do I ever go? Oh. I could have done this. This is a freaking closer one.
Oh, he's a mean fire, god damn it. Oh well. this fight one more time. And then stop. Just wanna do this. It's like, I guess I also get, um, a lot of my money from that, the battle pass. I guess whatever. I do more damage if I hit him in the eye, but whatever. Um... I'm just gonna, oops, I, how do I zoom out? That's weird, I zoomed in too much. One, two, three, three, four, and, um, ah. Uh. So I think I have enough of everything, it's just, uh, these frickin' violet grass. Oh, I was gonna see that if I could buy violet grass and wear, but I'll do that on my own time. I'll just uh, go here and frickin' turn this in and stop, because what time is it? Oh, 201? Well... Frickin' that's perfect. Oh, yeah, and the... What is it? The bounties freaking do that. I probably get more and more of uh, the higher, um... Like the higher I go, but there's no reason because it's, I have reputation 10 anyways. So like, yeah, why make, um, the, yeah, why make the game harder for myself? Uh, whatever, yes. Oh yeah, I was gonna end. I'm probably gonna play Stubbs Zombie and replay the missions I did yesterday. And, um, the damn mission. And I know what to do this time. It's just that I killed, um all the people so i screwed myself then i uh went back to checkpoint then 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone was still dead. So it's like, yeah, I screwed myself. Oof. Like, I, I didn't know you could do that, but whatever. Oh, probably, what, 30, 40 minutes to eat? Probably longer, like 40, 50 minutes to eat. I would say, probably shorter. But I just say that, then, um, yeah, I switch to Stubbs Zombie. But first, I want to say thanks for all watched. No, uh, good stuff. And yeah, I'll be right back in 4050 with Stubbs Zombie. I just freaking go to main menu. Because why not? And then stop here. And press the share button. Oops, that's the start button, idiot. Um, <laughs> whatever, stop.